The standard power pick kit is composed of the following components. The power pick gripper components can be moved and changed, depending on your needs. There are a wide variety of possible configurations. Secure the positioning plate in its designated spot on the offset tube by lining up its pin with a corresponding hole. Utilizing your hex key, tighten two 4mm M3 screws to fasten it into place. Secure the manifold onto the offset tube with four 35mm M3 screws and a hex key. Position the suction cup brackets and secure them to the selected offset tube. Then install the strengthening brackets to the opposite side, inside the offset tube. Secure the suction cup and strengthening brackets to the offset tube using the four M6 screws. The required torque is 9.5 newton meters. Fasten the suction cups to their air nodes. Secure the positioning plate in place on the 0mm offset plate, across from the self-clinching nuts, by aligning its pin with a corresponding hole. Fasten it using the provided hex key as well as 2 M3 4mm screw. Install the wrist extension on the 0mm offset plate, on the opposite side of the positioning plate. Align the little opening at the base of the wrist extension with the pin coming from the positioning plate. Screw the wrist extension to the positioning plate and 0mm offset plate with the provided hex key, 4 M6 screws and 4 M6 tooth lock washers. The required torque is 9.5 newton meters. Insert the manifold into its designated spot in the bracket, and secure it using a hex key with 4 35mm M3 screws. Install the suction cup brackets on the same side as the positioning plate. Using the provided hex key and 4 M6 screws, screw the suction cup brackets to the 0mm offset plate. The required torque is 9.5 newton meters. Secure the manifold in place on your wrist extension by fastening it to its bracket. Ensure that the pin on your wrist and the corresponding hole of the bracket are properly aligned before tightening them together. To reposition your suction cups, start by unscrewing the air bolts with just a few turns of your hand. Slide and adjust each node to fit into its respective oblong hole and then securely tighten each bolt back up. Using the provided hex key, unscrew the suction cups and remove them. If necessary, use a wrench to hold the air bolts. Install the desired suction cups on the air nodes. Make sure that the suction cups are tight so there is no air leak. If necessary, use a wrench to hold the air bolts. Take out 4 M6 screws from underneath the offset tube using the provided hex key. These hold both suction cup brackets and two strengthening brackets in place. After repositioning them as desired, securely screw them back into their respective places on the offset tube. Use the provided hex key to unscrew and detach the suction cup brackets plus two strengthening brackets that are located beneath them. Take the selected suction cup brackets, and reinstall the components in the desired position on the offset tube using M6 screws. Be sure the self-clinching nuts of the strengthening brackets face upwards when screwing back in place. 